Wayne won a Grammy Award a I couple know. years ago. Now, I picture Wayne, you know, he's been waiting for this Grammy Award for his whole career. So I picture in his house, it's like under a big box of glass with lasers around it <laughs> where nobody can touch it. It's probably in like a pretty awesome spot. Some people put their Grammys, you know, like in the bathroom or it's nowhere <laughs> it, creative it is, like that. Where is yours? <laughs> it, it is in an awesome spot. It's in the music room. Okay. Perfect. But that, I mean, it's not guarded by lasers. Like Ocean's <laughs> Eleven type stuff. Yeah, you know? nobody can get in there. Yeah, yeah. You know, but you got to have a code uh, to get in. Mm-hmm. It, it's, it's a pretty amazing feeling, my friend. So you know? it's like every time you look at it, you just crack a smile. It's like wow. <laughs> you know, it's so funny. You know, uh, you know, and people uh, view things different. But you know, I, I remember when I uh, when it first came in because it takes. I mean, it takes four or five months for it to come in, you know, after you win one. So that they hand it to you on stage and they say, give well, it back to me. It's a duplicate. It, it's not a real one. It's just a dummy one for you to hold. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. So, and then, because, you know, they have to engrave the names and stuff and, and, and put all the credentials on it. Anyway, when it come in, I put it on the sofa and I sat with it on the sofa by myself. <laughs> You know, I mean, it's an amazing achievement. You know, I mean, absolutely, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears behind it. You know, and uh, was it hard uh, to believe when you heard your name? Yeah, I mean, Daryl almost hit the hit the roof (laughs) at the Nokia Center. You know, Uh, no, it it was amazing. It's an amazing feeling. Uh, The whole trip was was great. You know, we got to walk down the red carpet and uh, see a bunch of stars. uh, Yeah, you know, I mean, you run into people like, yeah, man. I know TV. that, dude. Yeah, man, you know, and... Uh, They're as weird as I thought they were. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, Kathy Griffin flipping everybody off. She <laughs> lost, lost, lost. <laughs> <laughs> so it, it, it was it was a pretty amazing feeling, you know. Uh, the guy from Warner Brothers that been in Warner Brothers for years, Bob Merlis, uh, he took uh, time out of his you know schedule to uh, walk us down uh, the red carpet, and it was uh, just an amazing experience that I'll never forget. Yeah, you know? congratulations and, you know, again. It, thank you, and uh, you know, and if it never happens again, that's fine. Uh, that's fine, you know. Uh, being nominated. Was uh, a win for me. Yeah, I mean, it was nice to, to be able to get the Grammy, but for them just to mention my name, yeah, in the middle of that pack with all those great artists out there, it's a, it's an amazing feeling. Well, now with the new song, a good one, and you might be getting nominated if it gets up there. Well, it might you, be ACM or CMA. <laughs> well, well, you know what? Let me just say this. You know, and uh, we we don't do it for trophies, right? We do it because we love the music, and you know, we have wonderful fans, and uh, we really enjoy uh, going in the studio and and creating really, really good songs and putting our hearts behind it. But it's it's not about the trophies or what if we're going to win something. We've already won when we've created the song.